Well, it's winter in Wisconsin, and there is nothing better than a warm bowl of soup. Today, I'm here at the Jones Dairy Farm up at the farmhouse, which is a historic location. I'm going to go on inside and meet Philip Jones, the president of Jones Dairy Farm, and Chef Kate, who's going to share with us a sausage soup that is sure to warm your belly this winter. Philip Jones, you are the sixth generation president of Jones Dairy Farm. Chef Kate, as well here, you've been with them for a long time. Philip, tell us a little bit about the Jones Dairy Farm history. Wow, that's, <laughs> we need a lot of time, but just in a nutshell, we were a dairy farm in the 1800s, and that evolved into what we are today, which is a meat company. Specifically, we make all natural pork sausage, we make dry aged bacon, and some wonderful hams that are smoked with real smoke, not liquid smoke, and we try and really emphasize clean ingredient statements. So in a nutshell, that's what we do today. Since the 1830s, and we're local in Fort Atkinson, and one of the things that's really amazing is we're still privately held and we still manufacture 98% of what we produce within one mile of where our great, great, great grandfather settled. That's a very unique story in and of itself. So we're in the Jones Dairy Farmhouse right now. And Chef Kate, you've been with the family now for what, eight years. Talk a little bit about the recipe you're making today. So I started out in the pot. We have, as Philip said, we're using our all natural golden brown links. In this recipe, you can use the roll sausage. You can use any of the other varieties, turkey, chicken, maple, any of these would be great in here. We've got the links cut up. I've got onion, carrot, and celery. And then I just added in a little bit of Italian seasoning and a little garlic and we're just letting that cook for a minute. And the other thing you could do is alternate in a ham or a bacon instead of sausage. So it's a very versatile recipe. And as you said, during the cold winter months, uh, there's nothing better than a great bowl of soup. So you have choices and flexibility. Okay, Chef Kate, what are you mixing in now? So now I poured in the chicken stock and I added a can of tomato paste and that's just gonna help thicken it up as well. We're gonna let that cook for a few minutes before we add in our last ingredients. One of the things I love that you say about soup is that it's, this recipe is freezer friendly and I think so many families right now are looking for food that can last. It's a great way to prepare ahead and have something very comforting and everybody is so incredibly busy right now that having a quick dinner at your disposal is a great solution. One of the things I love is your Jones Market. I know people come to the Jones Market for all the food. You've got the brats, you've got so many other great flavors, more soups as well but it is truly a decorated destination for families to visit through the holidays. And you'll find some other really unique Wisconsin made products in the store to showcase what else and what other great products we have in our region. Okay, Kate, what's going in now? Now I have a little mixture of some heavy cream and a little bit of cream cheese that I had whisked together and left warming on the stove. So it's going in already warm and that's gonna give it that creamy look that we're looking for. And the second to last thing we're going to add in is the tortellini. Um, you can use refrigerated, frozen, whatever you would like. And then the last thing we would add in would be the spinach. So we'll wait with that. I do have one finished. All right, let's bowl it up. That's right. Right? And it's got all these wonderful pieces of sausage in it that you're going to be able to see. And this tortellini, it's just warm and, like you said, comforting. There you have it. There's Kate's tortellini soup with sausage. <laughs> And I can tell you firsthand, it's totally, it's wonderful. That looks delish. It says that right on the ball. That's right. <laughs> Perfect. Definitely Thank a you. pleasure as always. Thank you.